uh, welcome to learning artificial intelligence the topic 2 on our list is intelligent systems so what are intelligent systems while studying artificial intelligence you need to know what intelligence is what is intelligence it is the ability of a system to calculate to reason to perceive relationship and analogies learn from experience store and retrieve information from memory solve problems comprehend complex ideas the ability to use natural language fluently classify generalize and adapt to new situations so a person who has all these qualities is said to be intelligent all these qualities are possessed by almost all humans but the degree to which each quality is possessed by people vary and an artificial system should have which is an ideal clone to a human brain should have almost all the qualities listed here the different types of intelligence the different types of intelligence are linguistic intelligence such kind of intelligence are processed by narrators and orators it deals with the ability of speech and the power of words the, all the intelligence listed here are processed by almost all human beings and the degree to which a certain intelligence is more or less in certain humans lead to a person becoming a singer a mathematician or a narrator the second kind of intelligence is musical intelligence such kind of intelligence deals with the understanding of different kinds of sounds and musical instruments such kind of people tend to become good musicians and singers logical mathematical intelligence the ability to understand numbers and mathematical complex cities is known as logical mathematical intelligence such kind of people tend to become mathematicians and the examples of such intelligence can be found in mathematicians and scientists spatial intelligence ability to understand different kinds of visual objects the ability to recreate those visual objects without the reference to the objects again the ability to create 3d objects and understand them such kind of intelligence is known as spatial intelligence map readers and astronauts possess such kind of intelligence intrapersonal intelligence ability to understand one's own emotions and the ability to distinguish between one's own emotions is known as intrapersonal in intelligence persons like gautam buddha possessed high level of intrapersonal intelligence interpersonal intelligence the ability to convey one's idea to others the ability to convince others the ability to understand the emotion between two people is known as intrapersonal intelligence such kind of intelligence is found to be high among mass communicators and interviewers Next is what is machine intelligent? When is a machine intelligent? You can say that a machine or a system is artificially intelligent when it is equipped with at least one and at most all intelligence in it. So all the previously mentioned in, in intelligence when it is possessed, it, you can say that a strong artificially intelligent machine is possessed. A machine which is a perfect clone to a human brain is built. But even if a machine possess one of the intelligence, it is sufficiently said to be artificially intelligent. What is intelligent composed of? Intelligence is intangible. It is composed of reasoning, learning, problem solving, perception and linguistic in intelligence. If you break down each of those explaining further, Reasoning. It is a set of process that enables us to provide basis of judgment. The ability of humans to be able to have the power of judgment. To say what is right, to say what is wrong, to ability to take a decision. Such kind of based on judgment. Such kind of intelligence is delivered by reasoning. The power of reasoning or the intelligence of reasoning. The ability to learn. It is the activity of gaining knowledge or skill by studying, practicing, being taught or experiencing something. Humans are able to learn the ability to learn something new, the ability to learn a new skill, attend a new skill, the ability to being taught, the ability to practice a skill, all such kind of abilities form the ability to learn or the intelligence of learning. Problem solving. It is a process in which one perceives and tries to arrive at a desired solution from a present situation by taking some path which is blocked by known or unknown hurdles. Everybody fa faces some problem in their day-to-day -day life. The reason for those problems are known or they are unknown. But if we are able to arrive at a solution to those problems, the solution can be f is formed in humans by the method of problem solving or the intelligence of problem solving and one of the key factors which enable us to do problem solving is the ability to make decisions 
perception it is a process of acquiring interpreting selecting and organizing sensory inception information so perception is our ability based on which we acquire in information we interpret information we select what is good what is bad what have we acquired what we have we interpreted and we are able to organize those information in our brain linguistic intelligence it is one's ability to use comprehend speak and write the verbal and written language the ability to learn a language the ability to speak a language all this comes under linguistic intelligence it is one of the important factors for intrapersonal communication interpersonal communication the communication between two different people or two different person and two different entities the communication between an artificial intelligence system and a human will be possible by linguistic intelligence at a high level the difference between human and machine intelligence so what is the difference between human and machine intelligence humans perceive by patterns whereas the machines perceive by set of rules and data so humans store and recall information by patterns machines do it by searching algorithms so there is a search algorithm which a computer will go and search if you type something in a google search engine it will go and search all the database all the websites there for that information and it will bring out that information that's how a machine works that's how, how a artificially intelligent google search engine will work but humans will store those information in form of a pattern like 404404404 this is a very easy number to remember because it has a pattern so humans will store information in form of pattern they will recall it and they will recall it in form of a pattern which is simple to remember humans can figure out complete object even if other part of it is missing so if you give a incomplete data to humans they will be almost be able to figure out what it is but f to a computer or to artificially intelligent machine you need to provide the full set of data so if an artificially intelligent machine is to act like a human it should be able to figure out the complete object even when some part of it is missing while the machines cannot do it correctly so the goal of building a perfect artificially intelligent machine is bridging the gap between human and machine intelligence that's all in today in this video if you like this video please do subscribe like and comment also watch other videos in this series to get more knowledge about artificial intelligence